An underground fire caused manhole covers to explode and power outages in downtown South and Central Toledo. Victoria Idoni worked today to find out if this is a safety concern moving forward. Toledo Edison is working to fix an underground cable that failed, causing two manholes to explode and power outages in parts of downtown, south and central Toledo. Power was restored to customers within about three hours by bypassing the failed infrastructure and now crews are working to make permanent repairs. A spokesman from the utility company told me today that this is not uncommon in cities across the country. He said everything has a lifespan and with 80 to 90 year old infrastructure, things like this will happen from time to time. Toledo Edison also wants the public to know that there was no direct hazard to anyone, including their workers. Local businesses echo that sentiment. We are not open for business on Tuesdays, uh, so there really was not much disruption to our schedule, although it was very loud with an explosion underneath the street uh, blowing up the manhole covers, which was uh, quite thrilling. 20 North Gallery and other nearby businesses were evacuated temporarily as a precaution. Parts of Hensville closed throughout the day to fully fix the problem, but that didn't stop the fun there at any point. The stadium does not foresee any trouble from this moving forward. Today, everything is back to normal. Swamp Shop is open, Fleetwoods and Holy Toledo are open, so it's all status quo. Perry Street and South St. Clair Street were closed for about 24 hours following the incident and have now been reopened. From downtown Toledo, Victoria Idoni, WTOL 11.